What's up, y'all? Cup here. And today, I just want to talk to you. It's Tuesday, right? So it's like, why are you talking to us? Like, go play a game, woman. I, I know. I get it. Well, first off, you know, thank you for rocking with us last week. It's the way all these things go in a blur. I'm literally trying to remember out what last week's game was. What did we play last week? Um, Last week, security guards. Thank y'all for checking that out. I wasn't in the comments like I normally am, but I definitely saw y'all. Shout out to, you know, everyone that rocks with Cupton, whether it be on YouTube, whether it be on Twitch, and just anything we're doing. For those of you who do not know, I am currently hosting a show called The Replay on NBC Olympics Twitch. I've spent the past going on three weeks, two, three weeks, um, hosting the show for NBC for the Olympics in Hands down, it is the biggest hosting gig I've ever done. I know for a fact this is the longest I've ever hosted because it has been nonstop since opening ceremony. So it's like literally every day I have hosted a show for NBC Olympics on Twitch, which is insane. And I'm grateful and it's a moment and I will never forget it. And I'm surviving and I have until the end of this week. I will be back to normal on Sunday. I know you're like, okay, so... Good for you, sis. I know. You're like, where's your video? I'm going to be honest, y'all. In order to prepare for this, you know, I played a couple games in advance. And that way, all I would have to do is just edit them and then I would be ready to go. I'm going to be honest. I have said game, but I'm not feeling it. Went to edit it and I don't know, just watching it back is just like, this feels so conveyor belty you know like you, you see the old school like burgers and they put the burger on the conveyor belt and the next one and then the next one it was a smart thought but in looking at it you could i don't know to me it just felt like i love what i do i i love being able to play games with y'all for y'all it felt like i wasn't being me as much as you just got to crank out these videos so you can be good in advance to make sure you're not missing any deadlines i don't ever want content to become deadlines and feels as opposed to genuinely being invested and wanting to be a part, you know, and wanting to truly do this. It just felt different. I, I don't know. To anyone that's new here, I've been on YouTube for the better part of a year and a half, which is insane. It'll be two years at the end of this year. I have consistently posted videos every Tuesday for the past year and a half. Didn't matter what I had going on. And these past few months have been insane. Like I hosted E3 for Twitch. And then from there, literally the next week, I had to fly up north for Amazon to do a game show called The Crown. And then I still have streaming. And then I host a show on Twitch called The Weekly. We had a couple sponsored streams with like Pokemon Go and then we did something for Xbox. So it has just been non-stop for like the past. Well, they, no, we still had Resident Evil. That was a thing. So I was hosting things for RE while simultaneously trying to get in my RE because that's like my favorite great game franchise of all time. What are words? So it's literally been non-stop, but this is the first time like I've ever filmed videos in advance. And I'm like, okay, I'm going to go back and edit them. And if I'm keeping it real with y'all, I just wasn't feeling them. The first one, legit. Because, you know, in it to win it, let's go. The second one just felt rush and like, you know, wrap it up, B. I'm old enough to know, damn it, ma'am, trust your gut. For me, I'm sorry. And I appreciate y'all putting up with me. And I, I don't know. I definitely miss y'all. I haven't streamed. I've been just gone for the past like week and a half. And I freaking miss y'all. I, I I hate admitting it. I'll never admit it live. Y'all do not remember this. After today, this never happened. But it's weird not talking to y'all. Everything just feels chopped and screwed. Is that the best way to put it? But this is the first time, at least in my YouTube journey, I mean, maybe in my journey in general, where I felt like I created content that it was kind of like, it didn't feel real. It didn't feel genuine. It didn't feel awkward and questionable in every bad decision I make. And y'all know how I get down. Don't at me. It didn't feel like cupped and it didn't feel like home. And so I'm sorry, but I'll be back next week. We will be back to normal. I promise, promise. This is the last week 
Gonna finish strong and all that good stuff. I appreciate y'all rocking with me and putting up with me. I wanna make sure I'm doing right by y'all. And if I'm not doing right by y'all, then I'm not doing anything at all. I haven't complained about water with y'all for a while, so you know my stance on that. If you're drinking it, it doesn't need to be by the gallon, all right? You get your bottle, your singular bottle, and you do it. Don't look at this water bottle. Don't ask me how long I've had this water. That's irrelevant. Thank y'all for rocking with me. I will be back next Tuesday. I promise, promise, pinky promise. Look. I got y'all. I will be back next Tuesday. And y'all know the drill. Until then, I don't know. Y'all be safe in these streets, all right? Later, guys. <laughs>